just finished testing the Formula 330 CBR. This is Formula's new bow rider, but it even has a cabin down there. It's an all-purpose day boat, and what a rocket ship this thing is. We're packing twin Mercruiser 502s down below, and plenty of power. We got on plane in 5.1 seconds, 30 miles an hour in 9.2 seconds, with a top speed of 52 miles an hour. How's that for a 33 footer? This thing thinks it's a little sport boat though. Watch the handling of this thing. You can throw it around like a ski boat. And it has some attitude like you'd expect the formula to. Well Danny, a couple of years ago, Formula hit a big home run with the 350 CBR. And tell me about this boat. Well, the 350 did so well for us. Uh, we decided that the CBR was the way to go. Uh, we, you know, decided that people may want a little bit smaller, a little bit cheaper CBR, but all the same features. And we came out with the new 330 CBR. Started making this new lake boat revitalization of our boats. Uh, a lot of people are going to these convertible seating. For instance, here on the aft sun pad, you know, you can turn it around one side or the other based on, you know, if people want to sit here and hang out or if people want to be out the back. Yeah, you have lots of room for hanging. You know, we had seen the uh, single seat that could go, you know, we did that actually with our 270, but we actually had enough room here that we could split it. And right. so this would give you, this would give the passengers the ability to watch a skier out the back, you know, another spot to look out uh, while the driver is still looking forward and being attentive to where he's going. Very nice. Now tell me about the dash here. What do we have? Yeah, this boat, uh, come standard like with the Garmin 547. This boat we've upgraded to the Raymarine 9 inch um, touch screen chart plotter here. Uh, this boat also has Mercury with their Axia system, so it also gives you autopilot. We have the smart craft gauges, everything's all digital on this thing. Well, I noticed we're sporting uh, something over there that's pretty interesting. Yes, yes, the Axia gives you the um, joystick control. Uh, this pretty much makes driving a boat like a video game. I mean, you point the direction you want to go and the boat goes right there. Probably best to let your 14-year-old start to dock it and then have them teach you how to do it, I guess. Yes, huh? yes. <laughs> Let's check out the cabin. Yeah. Down in the cabin area, we got like a nice hangout area here. We got a uh, seat off to the side, you know, this way. We got a flip up backrest actually right here. You know, so a couple people can hang out down here and there's actually a television off to the side. Um, basically, you know, people with their bow riders haven't had the cabin ability, but we had the room here give you somewhere you could overnight. Um, this actually can fill in as a bed even. And the, there's actually room you can slide your feet under the walkway. Um, the other thing we did is we actually kept the head unit down in here. Some boats are split. Right. That just gives you the ability, if you need to use the restroom in the night, you don't have to get up and go outside your cabin. Well, Danny, I'm going to take a wild guess and say this boat is going to be very popular with NBA forwards. Yes, yes, a lot of, lot of leg room up here. Amazing. Uh, tell me the features up here. What do we have? Yeah, um, you know, a lot of room up here. It's a 33-foot bow rider, so you can see tons of people up here. Uh, I can show you here. We've got a convertible, you know, section of it up here, actually. You can even fit two people off to the side here if you want or extend out like I was. Nice. Also, you can fill this all in, make it into a giant, you know, sun pad. That fills in back there so you can fit a bunch of people up here. Right. The handling of this boat blew me away, how nimble it is. Mm -hmm. What kind of hull do we have going on here? It's a uh, 10 foot 3 beam, very beamy boat for its length, 33 feet long. Um, it drafts, I believe, 34 inches. Mm -hmm. um, so it's like it's, driving a 20 foot ski boat, sort of. Yeah. Yeah. No, our 350 actually, we came up with, you know, kind of a newer looking design for that boat and we really just hit the shrink ray on that a little bit. Yeah. We knew it was a great riding boat and sure enough, this thing turned out to be the same. Awesome. For more information on the Formula 330 CBR and other great boats, go to BoatingWorld.com. I'm Alan Jones and we'll see you out on the water.